Hello YouTube, I hope everybody is doing great. I got something new today. As some of you might remember, well the folks that follow me, this is a 2.1 inch round display that I did buy from Lilligo and I made a video about it. I will put a link in the description if you're interested. And today I received the T touch bar from Lilligo and I received this for free to review. I was very interested in this because it's something very difficult, uh, difficult, not difficult, different. And uh, I guess I said uh, it doesn't hurt to ask for a review item and they did send me to me. Thank you, thank you very much from Lilligo. And this is what you get with your purchase or with your item and it did come completely wrapped in bubble wrap and uh, in this bubble foil package so completely secure and uh, I just opened the lid and I closed it up again because I figured I make a video of it I might make several videos because uh, I have no idea about this thing and there is not much information and this is how it looks like let me take it out and as other people do we check the first uh, contents of the box which I actually do not like I want I want to know what I want to see this first so let me unwrap this nicely wrapped I don't even know where or how to open it okay here it goes and wow um, I have a lot of light in here now let me move the camera down well as you might see in the reflection it consists of two displays IPS color displays as far as I know and these are two magnets that you can attach this to your whatever enclosure you have and um, it has nice acrylic pieces to level it out and put it there and okay we have two buttons one is labeled reset the other one is boot and then you have the sp uh, esp32 chip i'm not sure which one it was let me check real quick if i can make it out no that's not the esp chip that's another chip i was wondering about the sh uh, shape of it so I assume the oh yeah the ESP chip is uh, underneath there. So and then you have this connector. And uh, anyway oh here is also I think this was oh this is a magnetic connector. Oh yes that's what I remember now magnetic connector. So okay let's see what else we got in the box. I'm very excited about this something new normally you have like displays modules and whatnot and this is definitely different so you have this flat ribbon cable connector and they always come in these nice boxes i mean this, this that's really nice and uh, i can't find the other box i got and actually this thing comes from germany and i did receive it pretty quick and here you have okay that's a metal bar with a self adhesive tape on the back not sure where you would put that and here is the USB cable nice uh, cloth pretty long and standard one meter I guess you have also a power connector this might be for battery I'm not sure yet 
Uh, so this will be the initial video and then I will make a video once I know what the, what I have. So it, here is a magnetic connector and as you see it's not just power, it's also data connector. It has that swivel head and USB of course and click and then it can even rotate because you have these rings. And uh, let's power it up and see what we get. I'm very uh, excited. Plugging it to my computer. Okay, we got a red, oops, red and blue LED. Wow. Uh, but this is a, uh, that's, Nice, but I cannot see it on my phone. It's a little bit dim. Let's see. Oh my god. This is adjusting. Uh, well, I have to figure out how you show you this better, but this is actually adjusting the volume on my PC. <laughs> okay, clicking that round thing, but why is this so... I need to get this brighter. Okay. Uh, that's also the brightness from my display. I didn't even know that you can adjust the brightness of the display. Well, here's a round circle. When you push on that, it goes back to the menu. Here's a shortcut for a website, I guess. And uh, yes, it does open a website. Oh, it does open your browser. There's a... Oh, here it has the search. Okay, now you can see it a little bit better. Okay. Yeah, it's good. It's really difficult to capture this. Anyway, yeah, well, that opens a web browser and the clock. Oh, actually, okay. It says connect to T touch bar to configure Wi-Fi, and here it shows fifty-seven. I don't know what that is. Well, I have to read up on this, of course. So, but this is the screen and you can see the two displays. But they work uh, at the same time. So you can, when you move it, they move at the same time. So this is, this is nice. Let me close this screen so my PC real quick if I can get to it. Okay, so the backlight is a little bit dim for my taste. Um, I don't know if I can adjust it, but anyway, I will leave this as the first installment and um, the head of the connector is a little bit tight so it doesn't move as freely so if you move it in your hand it gets disconnected but I mean you got at least six connections in here going from here to the head so still no complaints there and um, <clears throat> But so far, it's something different, and uh, 
I will come up with uh, something like maybe an enclosure for this. And um, as far as I know, it is based on the ESP32 S3. If I'm not wrong, I will have to check it. But I will let you know. Anyway, this was the first initial expression. I wanted to share it with you because it was also my first experience in expression of this module. And um, a small tip. If you want to order something from Lilygo, go to their store directly. You get a much better price. Uh, most expensive is actually on AliExpress. And um, it's cheaper on Tindy, where I actually bought my the 2.1 inch display. It's also a touch display with 400 by 400 pixels, so it's a very, very nice display. Um, and if you go to the official Lilygo store, you get it even cheaper. So save your some, yourself some money and go to their website directly, official website, Lilygo. And um, they really have some very, very nice uh, modules and displays and whatnot. And uh, you probably heard of them before. So this is a new product they have. It was sold, it came out, was sold out, and now I assume it's uh, available again. And um, with this connector, who knows what you can do with it? It's gonna be interesting. Anyway, this is a, the first uh, expression. If you want to see more, what it can do, what it cannot do, um, hit the subscription bar, hit the notification bell, so you will get notified about my new videos. Thank you, till later.